Welcome back to Projects on Board. It's Roland here, and today we are kicking off in our nice, somewhat organised garage. It's coming along nicely, very nicely. So I'm impressed with how it looks, impressed with how it's gone, and even more so impressed with how nice this looks up here. So I'm still yet to do something with this corner down here, but yeah, it looks good. Our armour is very well stocked. Our ducks seem happy up on a shelf with a bourbon. Life's good. Life's pretty good. So, at the, well, almost at the end of the last episode, we did have a, what do you call it, fly overhead, a uh, helicopter. So, I'm not too worried about it today, and I think I'm going to make the most of the safety and head back to the present police station, whatever you want to call it. We left an axe there. I'd very much like that axe back. Could be a bit of a ropey day getting up there, so the helicopter did cause a few distractions for us around, but... For the most part, I think we might be pretty good. Cleared out a whole bunch of Zeds down here and yeah, made the place mostly safe. There's bound to be a few herds here and there, but yeah, we can cross that bridge when we get there. But I think what I'd like to do, I was having a conversation with someone in the comments the other day and we were talking about a wall. And I think building a wall from this point to sort of that wall, are they in line? No, okay, well, to that window, and then boxing up all those windows. Doing the same over this side. Sort of from, I guess we could go from the corner. Get as much use out of the space as possible, and just, yeah, lock this area down, basically. So I don't really want any Zeds to be able to get in there. And then from that point, any open wall space on the outside would just put cars there. You know, break them down almost 100% and then put a roll in shells just out by the front door. And I think that's a great idea. We can always tear down the engines once they get to the door as well. Should be good. Got big plans for this place. Don't know why. I've just kind of fallen in love with the, in love with the base. So we're going to use it. But yeah, let's get the trip going up to the police station. Fingers crossed it's not as bad as it once was. Tell you what though, that helicopter has not taken any prisoners. We've got a lot of Zeds down here too. Feels like they have just multiplied rapidly overnight. So it's kind of scary, but kind of got to take it as it comes, don't you? Ah, new axe in there. Lovely. Definitely going to make the most of that. So I'd like to start using the axes. I put it off for, uh, what is it, six, maybe seven months now. Would be nice to finally give them a go. We've got plenty, plenty stored. Why not use them? I think I think we've got about 15 axes overall just sat in the base, doing nothing. Found through the back of Zed's heads. Uh, I think we've still got loads at the fire station as well. We've just been a very, very busy man. Covered a lot of ground and found a lot of weapons to do it and basically just used one. The short blade has been an absolute machine start to finish for this run. But yeah, I'd like to start sprucing it up just a little bit. We've got zero axe skill at all. Wow, 11 points. Doesn't really count. Should you give it a go now? We've got the post office to rest up if need be, so... No time like the present, eh? Absolutely horrendous. <laughs> Tell you what though, our strength should be on the rise soon. That's one skill that has been just progressing perfectly. Fitness is always a struggle. Never really know how that works. You need to have a little Google. But strength seems to just fly through. I think we're almost level 7. We started just on standard. Yeah, we're not far off both, actually. 20,000 XP. We'll be there probably by the time we make it to a year, to be fair. Doesn't, doesn't go up that quickly. Oh, this place got busy. Maybe our safety in the post office plan was not a great plan after all. Brilliant. Yeah, not a safe plan. Get me through the door. Let's just take care of this guy. And then we've got nothing... Nothing behind us. Ridiculous. Court of guard, still five swings. We need that extra level ASAP. Alright, this guy should go down. Nope. We have got an extra hunter knife though. I think she's just about to go down. 
There we go. Yeah, this this axe grinder is going to be fun, <laughs> to say the least. Get out of here. All right, where does that put us on the level? Almost level one. I'll take that all day long. I'll take you all day long. Uh, six rounds, beautiful. Better rack it as well. Dump it on the ground and move along. This could be the last gal. Come on, I'm ready for you. Oh, oh, <laughs> you're joking. We are one swing away. Is there a little stray Zed we can pick off? What's that? It's got to be a bread knife. I'm not taking the chance. Ah, here we go. You're going to be level one. Beautiful. Thank you, sir. Cooperation to the grand cause of level 10 axe has been marvellous. I think it's starting to get late, so I think I'm just going to try and dart around them all. Don't really want to get exhausted or tired by the time we make it there, so easiest thing to do, just run around. Why not? Don't think the car trips have been too kind to this place either. This is looking like barren territory number two, do you know what I mean? The Zeds are just unreal, aren't they? I think this way should be safer though. Pretty sure this will take us more or less straight to the ambulance. Even still, still pretty heavy up here. Oh yes, because it doesn't, that's why. <laughs> we might have to take a left turn somewhere. Um, yeah, not here either. Oh, maybe it does. Just turned a little bit too soon. Yeah, this is just beyond the courthouse. No, it's not. No, I'm completely lost. That looks nice too. I wouldn't mind checking that out whilst we're here. Could be our return car. Come on, fella. Big old V on your back. Zero percent gas, but everything else looks wonderful. Could be a contender. Maybe not today, but definitely in future. So I got lights on, or is it just me? They do look very bright, don't they? It's locked. No headlights on. Battery's still charged. Yeah, maybe the lights aren't on. Weird. Very weird. Alright, this place should be dead quiet. You shouldn't even be here. What are you up to? Alright, where is the axe? Where is the axe? We got her at just a terrible time, didn't we? I mean, if it's in there, it'll be over in that corner. But I'm going to struggle like hell to find it now. So I think I might head back to the gun store and just spend the night. can work it out in the morning. Hopefully the trip down here is also silent. Almost. Gear my fellas. There we go. Lovely. The neighbour also doesn't look too great. Where were you guys in the great, great extinction of Zeds? It's nice to see the aftermath though. It's a very welcome sight. Get out of here, boy. And just for you. Yeah, may as well use it for you too. See ya. Nice. Alright, let's go get some sleep and crack on with our day. Alright, the hunt begins. Fingers crossed we did actually leave it out here and I haven't just made a full wasted trip. Feel like it would be inside the little shack if we did. Oh no, that's it there. There she is. So glad it's here. And we've got a fresh one too. Lovely. Alright, how does this look inside? You coming in? Yes, you are. 
Oh, this brings back memories. Brings back big memories. Hey, old fella. We're almost going to get a reenactment here, aren't we? <laughs> if we're not careful. So I believe all of these tend to be pretty well stocked with food. Maybe not. Maybe not. I remember using one in Raven Creek, I think. And yeah, just clearing it out with food, basically. There's so much cereal, so many chips, all of that stuff. But this one, there doesn't seem to be anything. There we go. That's exactly what I was looking for. All just high calorie, easy snack and food that we can eat on the move. It's exactly what we want. Don't really care about tins and stuff at the minute. That's all just resting food, basically. We also need a bandage. Inventory is getting very full very quickly. So I'm also kind of thinking we do have a pretty good opportunity up here to chop down all of the woods in the park opposite. Load up the blue truck we've got behind the gun store. Just shift them all home. It'll make life so much easier and pretty much get our wall underway immediately. I can't believe I've left a few of these behind. I'm going to go grab them all. Tell you what, I do love the way this looks, even though it has made it incredibly dangerous. It's just so cool having a little burned out entrance. Uh, your dog. Uh, that's not good. Glad we got that bandage though. Come on. Must have done an arm or something. Hand. It's been a while since we've died from a scratch, and I'm a little bit worried. I won't lie to you. Gotta get the aviators back. So I feel like there's, it's only a matter of time before the zomboid gods do just kill us off, really. <laughs> it's bound to happen sooner or later. Give me that, fellas. This is not really a situation I thought I'd be in. Never really thought we'd get this far, but I'll take it. Chips. One hearty Z. One toy bear. Ah, oh, it's too heavy. There's one sneaky little Z just around here. Maybe they're behind. Tell you what, if we keep them well fed, it'll do them some good. I think that might be the last one. Cool. All right, well, let's let's go get some trees chopped, shift them home, and then yeah, we can begin begin building a wall. It's gonna be a good day. Yeah, if we start down this end and just work our way up and through, we're gonna have tons of wood. How come we can't chop these? Guess it's because they're maybe on an ash pile. Yeah, very weird. Very weird. Do also need to go and get some sheet ropes as well. They're going to be pretty crucial. Didn't even check if the car had fuel. I think we have got another car with fuel. Just behind, yeah, just behind the courthouse. We should be good. Should be fine. So many trees. Yeah, the ones on the ash piles, or just the burnt tiles, I don't think we can do. Or the burnt trees. Very weird. I wonder if we can do them by hand. Christ. We need to go rest. Not worth the risk out here at all. Alright, we need as many sheet ropes as we can get, basically. The more we can get, the better. So I don't know how many we're actually going to need, but probably at least 20. Hopefully we can get all 20 from here. Seven. We're really quite a few up. Um... Nothing from you. Oh, I'll take the denim strips, though. Can't go wrong. Dirty or not, you coming over me. Um, can we get a cheeky chin stab? Mm. More zeds the sketcher it gets. 14. That's perfect. That's exactly what we need. Lovely. Um, can I try and hop in the back, or are we too overweight? 
probably too overweight. Risky, risky, risky. I can hear a zombie. Here, fellas. Come on. You know you want to go down. There we go. Right, let's just let's just do the smart thing. So I did put a nice black office chair in the center. So should be able to get rested nice and easily. Let's just dump all of these and prepare for the chaos. That was only one. Only one. Hello, man. Sweet mana jammer. Nice. There's always more. Always more. Where's your friend? There she is. Ready for her too, just so you know. Come on, you little grey haired goddess. Get out of here. Right, let's go round up the logs we've got. 10 sheet ropes, 20 sheet ropes. 10 stacks of 4 gives us a lot of logs. 40 logs, 3 logs per thing gives us 120 logs. If we can't build a wall out of that, I don't think we're ever going to build a wall. <laughs> it's just fingers crossed we can actually carry them. Um, eight. Beautiful. Four more to go and one stray log. Perfect for the pack in the corner. Make a four log stacker. How about you? You'll come with me. So six yeah not quite what I'm after but it'll do there we go all right now we just need to find fuel as uh, job numero dos think that puts us in a pretty good spot leaves the axe on the ground whilst we're digging I'm pretty sure the car just around here should be good we do need what like 120 space though it's the only downside Come on. Out you come. There we go. Oh. Good thing you weren't a lunger. I would have been a very dead man. Is it this truck? No. Only 60 space in that one too. Did we move it or did we leave it? I think I might have moved it. Unless that's it there. Yeah, nice. There we go. Lovely. How much gas can we get out of this? Or should we just move it to the other one? Siphon it all out straight across. That works too. Please start. There we go. I think that was actually a pretty big brain move. Just siphon whatever gas we can. Bang it straight into this one. They're gonna be gonna be flowing through anytime soon. Did also have a bunch come around the front as well, so it's gonna be a sketchy day. There's one. I right, don't actually know how much gas that does, but probably not a lot. 1911. So a rest site from a normal police set. Where are you, fellas? You came flowing through. Why have you stopped? Almost. Don't know why I just clammed up and froze then, but it's almost a death sentence. See you, Crawley. Oh, there's a lot of door hinges and stuff here as well. If we've got any spare space, definitely going to load all of those up. And how many more of you are flocking about in here? There we go. Last but not least, she down to ah a duffel bag, nice. Can't remember how much space they hold, but hopefully it's like 24. I think it's 18. Yeah, not really gonna do us any good, but I'll leave it on the ground anyway. A couple of military packs would have been the one. Two stacks per thing would have saved me a whole lot of hassle. Alright, let's go. 
finish off loading up the stream with fuel. It's going to take all day. <laughs> Ridiculous. All right, I think this one should do. Gives us whatever, 1.25. Ah, five units of fuel. Yeah, we're just above empty. That works for me. Let's get all of the doors unlocked. Maybe the lock's broken. That'll do it. That'll do it. It's a pretty banged up truck. Wouldn't mind getting a new hood for it. Or repairing the hood. Whatever comes first. Let's just sneak our way around. I think I might back it up in. Back it up, back it up. Dodge all the trees if we can. Straight down to our log pile. We've got a couple of Zeds coming in. I'll just take care of. Get him on number one. Oh, we got three. Sport for choice today. There's two. Cross. And there's three. Ah, the fourth swing. Should have known. Should have known. Oh, I'm kind of hoping we can just load up as many as we can. I think it was 102 space in the back, which gets us almost what we need. So very nearly what we need. If we can just put one in the front and one in our offhand, we'll be fine. I reckon we can get all of these home today. And we need to bring the wood axe as well. Can't forget that. Most important thing. Only thing I came out of for. <laughs> the logs were just a nice bonus. 12, 24. And that's the end of that. Can also get the wood axe in there, which is good. And then two more to go. We could just keep them in our bag. But I think, yeah, one in the secondary. One in our main inventory. We're good to go. The rest of the logs can wait until we return. Would like to see if this is broken. Yeah. Wonder if we can replace that door. No idea how it works. But yeah, let's get ourselves home. Alright, we made it back in one piece. And we're looking pretty good. I think what I'm going to do is just spread some of these around before chopping them down. It's always way easier. And it gives me a little bit of room to sort of work out where we want stuff. I think I'm going to go for this corner. I've decided. So that way, any Zeds that get pulled out, I can just sort of pick off. Should be good. Should be good. I think... I'm going to want a door right about there, so we can leave a big old four stack right on that corner. I think we're going to run out very quickly here. Yeah. Where can we go? Primary, secondary, and whatever else we can, whatever else we can squeeze. And then, what is it? Four, eight, twelve. Twelve logs per thing, that gives us three walls. That's not a lot. That's really not a lot. And one, two, three. Go to the fourth. We also want a gate over this end as well. One, two, three, four. That should do that side. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. And then from this side, it's going to be straight from that corner point. Uh, don't like you guys. Not at all. I wonder if we've got, if we've got the minerals. Damn it. Only downside to having the cars. What are you up to? <laughs> There's already a Z in there. I do love that they can crawl under cars. Remember the good old days of just building a little car fort around you, setting them all on fire. Wonderful. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful. Uh, I think that's us. Should also rest and sleep. We'll do that and then finish off. And you know what? Just whilst we're here, we may as well make them some tasty pancakes. One uncooked pancake. Should we do them all? Well, all from one pack, anyway. Make all. Oh, Christ, that's going to do a lot of pancakes. <laughs> oh, we've still got two boxes left. Nice. Seven uncooked pancakes. We're going to change that. Nice. Seven fresh cooked pancakes. Pancakes add random chocolate. Should also be able to put some peanut butter on there, surely. And honey. Mm. 
There we go. Add some butter. Add some marmalade. Add some margarine. Have we not got any honey? Oh, now that is sad. I've never put butter on a pancake, but now that I'm seeing it, it does sound quite tasty. Oh, and he's full. So nice. Does make me happy seeing him full. Definitely deserves it. And our, and the, our losing weight bit is gone. Dread to think how many calories they are. All that butter on as well. Unreal. Another nice pancake to start the day. Minus 35 plus the boredom and unhappiness. How did you get in? I need to do something about these windows. I think we need to do it today. There's only one as well. There's only one entrance around the back. Unless he's busted down the door. I should you have a look? Yeah, there you go. Broken in through the door. Two entrances. Metal doors are going in. Not today. I'll do them tomorrow. Today we've got a wall to build. Wouldn't mind getting that polished off today. Um, do we have any nails on us? Of course not. Why would we? We can worry about those in a sec though. You'll do as two. Equip primary, equip secondary. I believe we've already got one over there. Do also want to navigate this side too. Don't really want to be dragging a car in and out without one. Does not sound fun. Two, three, four. Clear our hands first. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I think that's all we got. Okay, well we can get the wall underway. We probably won't get it finished. But any start is a welcome start. And I mean, if we end up having logs left over, happy days. I reckon we start over this side though. Need to measure it all out properly. I just want to double check what these are. I think it's four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so if we get that perfectly central in the road, it would just make me happy. <laughs> Can't be having an off center gate. And then, yeah, we need to shift some dustbins and cars around behind these block off any sort of access that we can and also take care of any Zeds before we get started howdy friend come on there we go quite a few doorknobs and hinges in here though definitely use those to our advantage come on This axe skill takes forever, but we are almost level 2. Not bad going. That went quick too. Very quick. Alright, what have we got? We need some nails. Let's get these bad boys unstacked and get them all cut down. 24 planks. Whatever that gets us is kind of what we're stuck with. So I'm going to make one little pile per side as well. Those sheet ropes are going to come in so handy later. Um, also need to work out what central is. I'll do it straight off the corner. Uh, I might put a normal little doorway there. And then the road is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, so we need 1, 2, 3, 4 clear. So we just get those in first. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2... One, two. Lovely. Working out nicely already. That's probably perfect for a doorway there, to be fair. Just maybe just try and get the thumbnail in for him. Hopefully I'll remember that. I'll probably forget it and do something completely random, but it's a nice idea. <laughs> you going to be a stumpy? Are you going to be a stumpy? You are. And a beautiful one, too. Won't bother about a doorway this end. And stack the the logs. Don't know what I was going to say instead there, but <laughs> something came out. And it started with a B. Alright. 
just kept working our way back in. Kind of regret not putting the doorway that side, but am I ever really going to use it? Let's be honest. If we got one the other side plus a main gate, nah, we'd be alright. We'd be alright. Doing well though. Don't think we're quite going to have enough all over, but we're doing well. There we go. Not going down just for building a wall, I can tell you that. It's going to be absolutely wonderful when all of these bodies disappear. So looking forward to that day. Should probably take care of those guys too. Um, can we do this the easy way? Almost. I don't want to waste a bullet. Six, seven, and eight. Wonderful. One, two, three, four. All right, we might not get the gate in, but we've got pretty much everything else. Oh, do we get the gate? Do we go and track some door handles and stuff down quick? Yeah, we're going to have to. And get the last wall in as well. The last wall is always a good start. Nice. Uh, plenty there for the door. And then... Ah, we don't have any wood left. Okay, fair enough. We're going to have to leave it as a slightly empty shell. Guess we could do one door, couldn't we? Could do one door. Carpentry, wooden door. We're so close. Four planks left. One big old hole to fill. But we've done well. I'm kind of happy with that. Happy enough to call it a day and be satisfied anyway. But yeah, I'm going to love you and leave you just there. Thanks for watching. Massive thanks to member supporting the channel. Like, subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.